Hello, I'm Luke Newson. And I'm Nicola Coughlin. And we're going to play Name That Love Story with IMDb. Okay, which movie is this quote from? Promise me you'll survive, that you won't give up, no matter what happens, no matter how hopeless. This film takes place in the early 1900s and was directed by James Cameron. Oh, it's... it's okay, yeah, of course it is. Titanic. Yeah. Yes, yes, you got it. And uh -huh. do, you think, do you think they both could fit on the door? <laughs> well, I actually watched a thing when James Cameron did like a full science experiment where he got two people. He was like, see, they couldn't fit on the door. And that dude knows about the ocean. So I'm like, yeah. let's let's just leave him off. He's yeah. been suffering since like 1998 or whenever that movie came out. <laughs> I'll never let go. Next one. The quote is, I never saw true beauty till this night. This film was directed by Baz Luhrmann. It's go another it. Leo. It's Romeo and Juliet. Oh, great. We're Leo theme yeah. right now. He was so fit in that movie. Hell yeah, he was. <laughs> he was awesome. I love the Facts. nods. Facts. Yeah. <laughs> I never saw true beauty till this night. Oh, it's in the first Bridget Jones. Yes, yes, you got oh, it. You got yay. it. I'm glad well, I have was, a teammate. It was, it was your context clues, <laughs> not not me knowing it. <laughs> what would you do if you found out your friend or family member read your diary? God, I don't have one. I have I have an old one from when I was like. 16, which I've reread back and gone, oh my Gosh. Jesus. <laughs> I'd be like, why would you do that to yourself? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very embarrassing. Jokes on you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, mortified, I think. Yeah, mortified. Yeah, yeah. it's a good way to put it. <laughs> right. <laughs> Love actually, actually. baby. <laughs> Really bizarrely, I'm also in a show called Big Mood in which there is a Love Actually birthday party themed episode and I had to dress up as both Laura Linney's brother <laughs> and the kid in the octopus costume. So I feel like I have an extra special connection with Love Actually now. Yeah. <laughs> We're all connected. When it comes to costumes, do either of you have any wardrobe malfunctions during the show? Not us two. I think we were all right. We're perfect. Yeah. We never did anything I mean, much. if costumes needed to come off, they were intentional for us. <laughs> I don't think it was any yeah. mishaps. I know. Well, Luke had to learn how to unlace a corset. Yeah, I did. Yeah. I'm I'm a pro now. Yeah. It is a chance to make a name for myself. Poetic justice. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. You got it. See, I'm a black woman, okay? I deserve respect. If you could star opposite a music icon, who would it be? I know who yours would be. Who? Shall I say it? Yeah, go on. Dua Lipa. <laughs> yeah, maybe, yeah. Must you even ask? If you could cast a music icon in Bridgerton, who would it be? Who could we bring in? We could like Harry Styles. You love Harry Styles. Yeah. We could imagine both his costumes. Have fun with They'd him. be. He he would get on with. I think he'd have a great time with Benedict. They would really. I would tear love up the to town. watch that yeah. in the least creepy way possible. <laughs> I do not doubt it. Okay, the next quote is, I can't be a princess. I'm still waiting for normal body parts to arrive. One of your Bridgerton castmates starred in this movie and it takes place in Genovia. One of our castmates starred in it? Oh, Julianne, Princess Princess Diaries. Oh, God. I was like, why was I that? Like, Adjua? Yeah. <laughs> Adjua's just been in so much stuff. I was like, it has to be yeah. Adjua. And it was Julie Andrews. Oh, amazing. Yes. Shut up. I beg your pardon. Shut up. Nicola, I talked to Claudia and she says that you have a great Lady Whistledown impression. Do I? Do I? <laughs> She's absolutely I Well, up no, there. there was. Yeah, I'm like, okay, Claudia. Uh, yeah, Claudia can rap all of my. Think of a song. Um, no, I think just one day, it was actually an unintentional impression because we they asked me to record a voiceover for a promo for Netflix's To Doom mm. and they were like, you could read it as Lady Whistler, and I was like, oh, so I really went for it. I was like, dearest gentle reader, today we shall be speaking to Colin Bridgerton, and they were like, just do it in the normal Penelope voice. Why did you try and do Julie Andrews? I was like, oh, sorry. That's okay. brilliant. Yeah. Dearest reader, today is a most scandalous day indeed. Have you had the chance to meet her? I never have. Mm -hmm. I would die to, but also be so nervous. Yeah. Do people just fawn over you? I Which film is this quote from? Rachel, these people aren't just rich, okay? They're crazy rich. John M. Chu directed the 2018 rom-com. Crazy Rich Asians. That Thank you. Yes. That. What's your favorite scene from that film? That really elaborate party. Like, oh, on, yeah. And it's just like the first time you <laughs> see like the wealth of the family and you're like, yeah. wow. He's directing Wicked. How cool really? is that? Really? Yeah yeah, 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 of course. Very excited yeah. to see that with our, our Johnny. Yeah. Which movie is this quote from? If you're a bird, I'm a bird. Notebook. 
Yeah, Kevin, you're a bird. I'm a bird. You got it. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. This is why we're a good team. Teammates. We like we yeah. pick up for each other's. Like mm. when I go, no, it's not. And he goes, it is, girl. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that would be from Bridgerton season one. Yeah. However, and, it's go. a very famous Mandela effect. Do you know who said it? It is Daphne. I burn for you. But I also so thought that uh, he says it. But I had gotten tricked into thinking yeah. that the Duke said it, and he yeah. never did. It's like the weirdest mm -hmm. thing. Even though we're in the show, it blew my yeah. mind when I first realized it was wasn't yeah. him. I think there are T-shirts made with his face. This hair, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was it was Phoebe. It was Phoebe. 